You can hide no longer. You now have the world looking directly at you. Hot roll, red roll. Engaged. What's up, guys? This is Mr. Fresh. Thank you for tuning in to my channel and taking the time out of your day to watch my video. Let's go ahead and get started. I have my Cali Linux virtual machine running and open here. You see the desktop uh, for that on the screen. And I am going to open up a terminal emulator here. Let's go ahead and get started with this uh, video. I want to show you guys how to quickly and easily install what is referred to as a meta package. And this meta package is specifically for uh, forensic utilities. Maybe you are interested in forensics or maybe you're just interested in the packages that come with this forensic meta package. Either or, it doesn't really matter. I'm gonna show you how to do it. There's just a lot of packages that come inside of this meta package and it makes it very easy for you. So you don't have to install numerous um, utilities one after the next manually. You can just install them all at once using this meta package. So even if you're not interested in forensics, wait till you see all the packages that come with this and you know you may want to just install them for other things that you may be doing. So in my terminal emulator here, uh, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm actually going to show you uh, Kali Tweaks. And if you're familiar with Kali Linux, then you probably already know about Kali Tweaks. Now, uh, if I open up Kali Tweaks, it takes us to the main menu, and you can see that second down here we have Meta Packages, and it says install specific subsets of tools for particular needs. Um, and if I hit enter, first thing it's going to do is it's basically going to run sudo apt get update for us because it, you want to have updated repositories first and foremost before you, you know, do your install. Now, the next thing that happens is it takes us to this menu right here and this is a list of meta packages. Um, and we have meta packages for basically our, our Wi-Fi uh, tools. So that's the 802-11 here, uh, Bluetooth, uh, fuzzing, GPU, hardware, RFID, SDR, and, and so forth, right? But if we scroll through these, um, as useful as they are, we don't see anything for forensics. So the whole point of me showing you this is you're not gonna get to this by going to Cali Tweaks. So let's go ahead and go back and let's, uh, quit. So if I use apt search and I'm just going to search for forensic, like maybe the typical person might do. Um, if I do apt search forensic, we get a lot of output on the screen, but I'm going to go back up to the F section. and we start to see some stuff for forensics. So, you know, you can search through this and find things that are very interesting for you. Um, you even have samples here using different file systems, uh, very interesting stuff to help you further your uh, understanding and hands-on uh, of forensic techniques and so forth, very good stuff. Uh, it can be a little confusing trying to figure out what's what and what you actually want, so I'm gonna try to make that a little easier for you. So if you come up here to the top, um, we have forensics all, and it says that this is a Debian forensics environment, essential components. You see it is a meta package. Okay. You also have the forensics all GUI. So here's your GUI components, you know, your point and click as opposed to command line. Then you have all these different other ones. Now, the one that we are actually going to be most interested in is going to be this one right here, the forensics full, and that is the full forensic station meta package. But first, I'm going to show you the forensics all. So let me clear the screen and I'm going to run apt info on forensics. Um, all. And the reason I'm doing this one first is because this one actually shows you the, the utilities that it comes with. So if we go back up here to the top, 
Uh, the package is called Forensics All, uh, version 3.47, as of the recording of this video, which is March of 2024. Installed size gives you all the uh, dependencies and recommendations here. Um, and then you have your description. This package provides the core components for a forensics environment. All here available tools are packaged by Debian Security Tools Team. This meta package includes the most programs to data recovery, rootkit and exploit search, file systems and memory analysis, image acquisition, volume inspection, special actions over the hardware, and many other activities. Then it shows you the following packages that are included in this meta package. So you can actually see all of the packages that are included, and there are a lot of them. Some of them may already be on here. Surely they are. And some of these you might not have um, thought were even you know, related to forensics. So this is why I say whether your focus is on forensics or not, a lot of this stuff you would probably be interested in having anyway if you if you have taken the time to download and install Kali Linux. So this is an easy way to get a lot of very important um, utilities. Now, um, I showed you the forensics all because it gives you that listing of the packages. Now I'm going to show you the forensics full, which is the one we actually are going to install. And if I hit enter on apt uh, info forensics um, full, you don't get that listing. So that's why I showed you the first one. But what this one says is that this meta package installs the first one I just showed you, as well as these other ones. So we are going to install the forensics all meta package the forensics all GUI meta package, as well as all of these other ones. So this is this is going to install basically multiple meta packages, right? Um, and in order to do that, we would simply run the command sudo apt install forensics full. And as you can imagine, there are a lot of packages, so this will take some time. And if I hit Y, we will continue. And at this point, um, I'll probably jump to the end of the installation and maybe quickly show you some of the icons. I'm, I'm not sure, but this is basically the most important part. This is how you do it. And um, uh, as you can see, there's just a lot, a lot of packages. So expect the install to take some, uh, some, you know, decent amount of time, and um, how much time it takes. Obviously, going to be dependent upon how fast your system is and your internet connection. But um, with that being said, if you don't want to see any of the actual packages, you can go ahead and end the video here. And um, if not, then. Uh, We'll pick back up here in a moment when the install has has completed okay so the installation has now finished and that did take quite a bit of time here um, if i were to scroll uh, try to back scroll up here on the uh, terminal here you'll see that there was just a, a lot of stuff that was installed I and mean, we got like 140 certificates and of themselves that were added so quite a bit of uh, packages and it did take quite a bit of time so now that that has been uh, taken care of if i go back over to my main menu here up in the upper left uh, portion of the uh, desktop here you will see that we actually have a category it's over here under number 11 and it is called forensics so if I go over to the forensics category that is now in my main menu here uh, you will see that we have a very long list of forensic uh, packages that are installed on our system now and if we take a quick glance through some of these uh, autopsy bin walk 
foremost, Galleta, Unhide, Yara. We can come up here to the top and if I expand the digital forensics tab here, you can see that there are more and the forensic carving tools. There are quite a few. It, usually if you hover over them, it gives you a brief synopsis of what the uh, tool is used for. So for scalpel, it is used to recover files using a header, footer, database. POSCO is a tool used to extract information from MS, i.e. cache files. Uh, under forensic imaging tools, we have a few and PDF forensic tools and finally then we have our sleuth kit suite which comes with quite a few uh, utilities and that's it so that is what it looks like after installing the uh, forensics full meta package on Kali Linux. Hope that you guys got something out of this video. If you haven't done so already, subscribe to the channel, like the video, post a comment. You want to see something else? Let me know. I'll be happy to show you. This is Mr. Fresh. Thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next one.